Buddhism is one of the most ancient belief system practiced by over 350 million people in the world. So basically Buddhism can be a philosophy and a religion because it teaches you a way of life. Buddhism is one of the most ancient belief system practiced by over 350 million people in the world. On that day, Buddhists across the world will pay homage to an Indian prince who forsook the pleasures of a royal household to bring peace and happiness to mankind over 2,500 years ago. Vesak Day, or also known as the Tri-Sacred Day, holds special significance for the millions of Buddhists who comprise a fifth of the world's total population. In thousands of temples across the world, from Tokyo in the east to San Francisco in the west, Buddhists will pay homage to Lord Buddha. The goal of a Buddhist is to become a Buddha. The goal of a Buddhist is to eliminate suffering. The complete elimination of suffering from our mind is possible, is definitely possible. That elimination of suffering from our mind, when we reach that state, it is called nirvana, in the general sense of the word. The day Buddha became enlightened or reach nirvana is a day celebrated by Buddhists all over the world is because that's what we wish to achieve. So we are celebrating our goals. Millions of Buddhists celebrate Wisak in India, China, Nepal, Sri Lanka, Vietnam, Thailand, Cambodia, Laos, Malaysia, Myanmar, and Indonesia. While the manner in which Wisak is celebrated varies around the world, the goal is similar, to recall Buddha's teachings and affirm an intention to follow them. Papa's Agranang is that we must try our best not to do evil things. We must try our best to do good things. Sachitta Pariyodapana. We must cultivate ourselves. And this is the, all the Buddha's teaching. Wisak expresses Buddhism's core beliefs in a variety of ways. The celebration centers on the triple gem of the Buddha, the Dharma or Buddha's teaching, and the Sangha or spiritual community. The first jewel is the Buddha, and Lord Buddha's importance is expressed through symbolic offerings to images of the Buddha and the celebration of his life and teachings. West Sound Day is celebrated for Buddhists around the world is to connect with our goal, connect with the purpose of practicing Buddhism, connect with the very person who showed us our potential the Buddha.
On Wisak Day, the Buddhist community around the world commemorates the important events that took place in the life of Lord Buddha. First comes the birth of Siddhartha Gautama, which took place under the arbor of sat trees, where Queen Mahamaya gave birth to him. The second event was Siddhartha Gautama's supreme attainment as the Buddha, the enlightened one under the Bodhi tree. The third event was Lord Buddha's passing away, also known as Mahaparinibbana, or the attainment of ultimate peace and bliss over 2,500 years ago at Kush Nagar. Wesak Day is a celebration of Lord Buddha's enlightenment, mainly along with his birth and his death. The second jewel, the Dharma or teachings, are also expressed in Risa and influence the lives of Buddhists who choose to observe them even more so during this time. Teachings of compassion and generosity and the beliefs in karmic rebirth influence Buddhists to engage in acts of dana or generosity. If you really can learn the uh, uh, Buddha's teaching and understand Buddha's teaching, it's definitely it benefit for people's life. So it is not only for this life as well as hereafter. Aspects of the Dharma relating to the birth, enlightenment and Parinirvana of the Buddha include the Four Noble Truths. The Four Noble Truths are the principles that the Buddhists should bear in mind on the day of Vesak because it is the day upon which the Buddha realized those truths. The Four Noble Truths constitute the highest truth in that they do not change and are true for each and every one of us. They are suffering, the cause of suffering, the cessation of suffering, and the way to the cessation of suffering. Tang 去行啊,去行動,去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去去
啊，就是人人更更更能够安乐，人人更更的和谐。所以净化社会是一个果，是要我们要看到一个成果。但是主要呢，佛教就讲点点名的一点，如果人心不净化，社会就没法净化。所以我们佛教实际上强调一个一个教育，就净化社会，首先要净化人心，所以人心净化，社会才能够净化。So therefore, Vaisakh Day is a celebration, connection, and spiritual remembrance of what we wish to achieve. That is Vaisakh Day.